Hey guys, so today I'm filming the first Get Ready With Me video that I filmed in a very long time. I've had lots of requests to do one of these since I've become a mum. And I have been reluctant because let's face it, if you got, I mean, if you're a mum, you'll know there's not so much of a routine as a like throw everything together in the morning. So um, I have done it. Uh, this is on a good day. Let me just do that as a bit of a disclaimer. This is a, my routine on a good day. Sometimes River will wake up at 4.30 and it will not look like this. Sometimes I'll not get time to put any makeup on or do my hair and end up looking like a hot mess. But this is my mum routine on a good day. I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's go. So our alarm usually goes off at 6 a.m., which if we're lucky, leaves us about 10 precious minutes to get ready before River wakes up. And those of you who are parents as well know that Getting ready without a toddler is a whole lot easier than getting ready when they're awake. So the first thing I do is hop in the shower and wash and condition my hair. I'm actually working with L'Oreal for this video, which I'm really excited about. I've been using this shampoo and conditioner for the past few months. It's the Dream Lengths shampoo and the Rapid Reviver conditioner which is amazing if you're short on time like I am in the mornings because the conditioner gives you twice as much care as a regular conditioner. So it's essentially using a mask, but there's no leave in time. So it's perfect for those of you who want to reclaim a bit of time in the morning. And for us, that's really important as well because our time in the morning as a family is the only time that we're all together during the day because by the time Mike gets back from work, River's asleep. So I'm just washing and conditioning my hair. I'm actually using the Dream Lengths version of this conditioner, but they also make a extraordinary oil one which is for dry hair and one for color treated hair as well so there's something for everybody then i am using my l'occitane almond shower oil which is a favorite this is a giant one and really just having a very quick wash i feel like i probably am in the shower for about four minutes in the morning then i wash my face using the lancome miel en mousse um cleanser this is actually run out and i need to buy a new one i was absolutely gutted so i basically just make sure all of my makeup is off from the day before. Next up, hop out of the shower and tone using my Pixi Vitamin C Tonic. Absolutely love this stuff. A little bit of a self tan on the face using my Tan Lux Super Glow. This is awesome because it's a hyaluronic acid serum, but it has fake tan in it, which is amazing. Again, if you want to save time in the morning, kill two birds with one stone. I'm also using my favorite eye cream at the moment, which is the Dr. Dennis Gross Ferulic Acid and Retinol Eye Serum, amazing. And my Elizabeth Arden Great 8 um, face cream, which is awesome. It has SPF 35 and it's just super moisturizing and really quick and instantly sinks in. Brushing my hair, brushing my teeth, generally getting myself ready for the day. I actually don't end up drying my hair till a little bit later, so I just brush it to make sure it's as straight as can be, and then head downstairs, let the dogs out, give them their breakfast. They're always very excited to see me in the morning and have a bit of a scrap for their food. Um, but yeah, so I feed the dogs and try and let them out for a wee before River gets up again, because it's more difficult to do it when I have to carry her around. I top up a bottle with milk for her, and then usually by this time she's either woken up or is kind of stirring so she goes in to see her daddy i pick out my clothes for the day um, i'm just wearing jeans and a shirt today and then i go and pick out river's outfit probably my favorite part of the whole day to be honest and today she's wearing one of my favorite outfits that she has some leopard leggings and this awesome frilly shirt i got from the charity shop love it i then usually spend a couple of minutes tidying up because by this point she has trashed the joint in our bedroom and got her toys everywhere and then mike heads downstairs with her so i make the bed and get dressed and basically just make sure everything is tidy up in our bedroom because if i don't do it now it will never get tidy then we make some juice this is something we've started doing every morning river absolutely loves it she has apples from the garden and carrots from the garden in her juice but well usually like half an apple and a couple of carrots in her juice you can see she's loving it and then i usually have beetroot and um, cucumber based one and usually most of the veg is from the garden mike's making some eggs this morning and i just make river's breakfast as well so she's having some toast some figs again from the garden raspberries from the garden and a little bit of scrambled egg for her breakfast and then whilst we are um, have a little bit of time before Mike goes to work. It's actually a Saturday when we're filming this, so Mike usually heads off to work about now, but if he doesn't, we have a little bit of time outside in the garden with Mike, which is so awesome. Um, we've been really loving cultivating our veggie patch this year, and River has been learning all about 
the plants and growing food as well so she absolutely loves it and here we are watering the tomatoes in the morning which is her favorite thing and actually we're pretty lucky to get her watering rather than just eating all the tomatoes and raspberries she is a fiend um whilst mike is still at home i take the opportunity to spend five to ten minutes run upstairs and do my hair and makeup sometimes i obviously don't get the chance to do this but when i do it's a real treat so i've been using the bare mineral stick foundation and the bare pro um concealer because they are super quick and easy Seriously, if you are getting ready in a hurry in the mornings, these products are an absolute lifesaver and I just use a synthetic brush to blend them in. Also been using this Tom Ford blusher, which is absolutely divine. Um, it's a really beautiful, natural, peachy color and it's just a really good everyday color. So putting a little bit of that on, my makeup day to day is pretty light like i said some days i won't get the chance to do this but um it's a real treat when i do and if i'm filming obviously i'll usually wear makeup as well so i'm also applying just a little bit of chantecaille um this is kind of a creamy it's a funny texture actually it's kind of like in between a cream and a powder eyeshadow i'm just applying this with my finger and then blending it in it's a like neutral brown color just really easy kind of basic slightly smoky eye then i'm using a kind of gray dark gray toned Givenchy eyeliner just on my waterline and a little bit underneath as well and smudging it in. Then the L'Oreal Paris Bambi Eye False Lash Mascara. This has just come out and it's really good. I'm a big fan. Um, and it's one of those mascaras that's easy to apply in a hurry as well. You know, some of them take a lot of layering. This one's not like that. Um, so I apply a little bit of that. And then last but not least, I pop on a little bit of lip balm as well. I'm using my Dior um, Baby Pink lip balm. I use this all the time, absolutely love it. I'm popping a little bit of that on. And then I also actually forgot to film doing my eyebrows. And I didn't realize till after I dried my hair, but I did do my eyebrows and I use the Hourglass Micro Brow Pencil. This is also new and it's brilliant. And then spend about three or four minutes drying my hair. It's pretty much half dry by this point. I just dry it off and then run a straightener through it. This is my kind of go-to if I don't have any time to do my hair in the mornings. If I have a bit more time, I'll curl it, but straighteners are the answer if you have no time. That is it. Hope you guys enjoyed it.